hello friends especially those you guys who cook like me all the time anyway so i didn't manage to do any uh meal prep this weekend so i stayed home today just to cook and clean and clear up everything and so i was um thinking you know sometimes we think we don't have enough organic produce and you know sometimes you want to eat something that's maybe not in season like peas by the guys i've been planting garden peas for like one and a half years and they have said no yesterday i still bought more seed and i'm still going to plant garden peas so hopefully we'll have those in the shop very soon and i've also planted some french beans so let's see how that goes but anyway guys let's eat what's in season let's eat what's available and for me i just actually made a choice to only eat what the farm and the shop provides and um and um you know what has worked for me also is that you know sometimes when the uh, vegetables don't look so beautiful carol always sends them my way which i really love and i'm able to enjoy them at home and i'm able to prepare you know food with them all you need to do is if you have an ugly looking carrot guys just peel it that's all you need to do if your you know like potato is a bit snipped and it looks uh, like a bit rotten in one corner just peel it and chop off the bad parts so let's avoid food wastage and so um i was wondering what to make today so i'm going to show you what i'm making today and yeah i hope you're going to like um my choices sorry guys i have a terrible camera and i don't know how to use a proper one but anyway so here i have um uh, vegetables which i want to roast so i had the ugly looking carrots here they are i have irish potatoes and i also have some eggplants so all i'm going to do is just add paprika uh, olive oil maybe salt black pepper and i'm good and right here i also have some peanuts which i got for the shop and i'm going to be roasting them to add to the granola that makes my life so easy so i just roast the peanuts sometimes i add a bit of raisins honey and oats and the kids have granola all week which i just add um I normally add, what do I add? Sylvia, talk quickly. You normally add bananas to the granola. And I also have an overripe um, popo, papaya. Don't mind, it has a bit of fungal attacks. That's nothing, guys. Just peel it out and it's perfect for you. We get this from Shimbahis. Um, and since our farmers are organic, they're not really using, you know, any pesticides or stuff. So um, there's nothing wrong with the popo inside. It's just the uh you know the um, skin is a bit ugly but i'm going to make my kids a very nice smoothie i'm really looking forward to that and we also have lots of cabbage unfortunately why my cabbage is so white which i don't really enjoy because i like to eat the green leafy part of it is that um you know the outer part was starting to get a bit bad so i had to peel that out so what i do with my cabbage i normally just steam it and we have it with rice or um you can even bake it do you know you can actually also fry your cabbage with bacon yeah that's a tip right there and finally something i normally do for meal prep is to squeeze all my lemons at a go then i just have lemon juice uh for my own use when when and how i ever want it and that works normally very very well for me so i normally squeeze lemons and i normally just pick about maybe five or six lemons a week so that i don't have to waste anything nothing gets spoiled and that makes that works very well for me so that's my random uh, video. Not too much fun anyway. <laughs> Sorry, I don't have my daughter here. She's in school and she's normally my videographer and editor. And I still feel that I still have to create some content. It may not be too much fun, but anyway. Sorry, guys. I mean, I'm not that big of an influencer that's, you know, all out there with big cameras, lighting. I mean, my phone is already so bad. But anyway, if you can see me and I can see you, that's all that matters. So guys, remember you can eat um, organic. I've only shown you such few few things few things and one thing please don't forget that um we're actually working towards making our food affordable and our prices are very very fair so when you hear us talking about sylvia's basket please do not fear that it's organic have no fear whatsoever it's affordable you can afford it you can eat well you can make choices to eat well so um sorry for the poor quality of everything but i love you guys and i just like to interact with you people just that sometimes i'm just too lazy or I'm just like, my camera is not good, or McKenna is not here to help me, or Kara is not here to help me. And I end up not doing anything, and that's wrong. We just have to keep moving, keep moving, guys. So choose well. Uh, choose well about what you eat. Uh, buy from local farmers like me and other organic farmers all around Kenya and the world and everywhere. You know, eat food that doesn't have pesticides, eat food that doesn't have poison. It's actually even sweeter. So, yeah. So thank you guys for yeah staying in for the few minutes. Goodbye.